In this video, we are going to continue with solving logarithmic equations. You will find this on page 404 in the Namibia AS level mathematics textbook y equals mx plus c to success. Let's look at another example. Just going to make it a bit bigger. Okay, here it is. Solve log x minus 3 base 2 plus log x minus 2 base 2 um, equals 2 log x base 2. Okay, very important. All the bases must be the same. Okay, now we start. So it's almost like we are going to first um, simplify it to one log word on this side. So one log word on this side. This one, we are going to get that 2 by bringing um, the power law, we're going to bring it up so that there's only a 1 in front. Okay, so I can follow this, I can follow the product rule where I write one log word and I multiply that too. That's the power law, it went up. Now I can take the logs away. Okay, and if I take the logs away, I'm going to find this. Then I just, it's a quadratic equation and I basically just solve it. I multiply out, I take over, and then I'm just simplifying, I get x is 8 over 5. And I must do the check. Uh, oh, there's a negative. Do you see? And there's a negative. So sorry, the, this equation has no solutions. Okay, remember always you must check your answers. You cannot find the log of a negative number. Okay. I want you to stop the video and I want you to do number B. Again, you can continue the video as soon as you are finished. Okay, let's do number B. Okay, here it is. Okay, now I'm first going to write it. So it's log 2 x plus 11 minus log 2 x plus 4 equals log 2 5x plus 23. Okay. Now, I, I gave you this one because you can now go, and, and that's what we'll be fine. You can f follow the quotient rule. But I think it's always easier to do the product rule. So look what I'm going to do with this one. I'm first going to take this negative one over. You can. So I'm going to end up with x plus 11 equals log 2 5x plus 23 plus log 2x plus 4. Okay, because now I can follow the product rule, because it's plus. And I'm going to have 5x plus 23, and I have x plus 4. And now I have one log word, one log word, I can take the logs away, so I end up with x plus 11. 5x plus 23, x plus 4. Now, if you didn't, if you made it a division, you can just cross multiply and you will also come to that. Okay, so if you were working there and you made this divide by this, okay, but it doesn't matter, now I'm going to solve it. So I have x plus 11, I must multiply out this bracket, so I'm going to get 5x squared plus 20x plus 23x, and now I'm just going to quickly say 23 times that 4, and that's 92. Okay, now I take everything to one side, so it's actually 5x squared. I can already simplify that, oh, but I'm, I'm going to just write it out and simplify now. Okay, I'm just bringing that negative x over. And then it's the 92 and the negative 11. And now it's easy to simplify. Because look, there is like, like, uh, where is, oh, I brought it over, but I wrote it incorrect. Uh, luckily. 
Sometimes you can just check it. It should have been minus x. I was thinking of that one. Okay, so now negative x. Okay, so there is also a like term. And this is like, and this is like. Just move this. So then I will get 5x squared. And then it's the 20 plus the 23 minus the 1. And that's 42. And then it's the 92, subtract the 11, and that's 81. Okay, and now you can use the formula, but this can factorize. Um, I just want to move up a little bit. Let's see to what can it factorize. Let's see. If I say 3 times 27, and I say 5, hmm, well, let's see. Five, five, no, it will not work like five and one. Let's see that. Because it's an addition. So it's 27 plus 15, and that's 42. The signs are the same. It's group A plus. So I'm going to get, but otherwise you could have used the formula. If it's a bit too difficult to see the formula, you know what I'm talking about. It's that minus B plus minus e squared minus 4ac over 2. That's the formula. Okay, you could have also used that. Okay, but now I factorize it. So it's x plus 3, and it's 5x plus 27. And I solve it, and I say it's x plus 3 equals 0, or 5x plus 27 equals 0. So x is equal to negative 3, or x is equal to negative 27 over 5. Okay. Now I must do the check. Always the check if it's locks. Okay, let's check. And I always put in the original one. So check. I can simplify this one also as, let's just see, um, so it's 25, so it's negative 5 and 2 over 5. So, let's do the check. Um, we put it in the original one, so it seems to me, um, I just want to see where is my original one. Mm -hmm. You can that, take that, I'm just going to write it quickly first down. So it's log 2, x plus 11, minus log 2, x plus 4, equals log 2, 5x. Plus 23. Okay, let's move it up and let's put it in. So this is going to be log 2, so it's going to be negative 3 plus 11 minus log 2, negative 3 plus 4, I'm still safe, and it's going to be log 2, 5, negative 3, oh, sorry, the pin. Come on, Ben. Come on. Negative 3 plus 23. And if you look at this, it's going to be log 2. And this one is just going to give you negative, oh, not positive 8. And this one is going to give you 1. 1 is right. And this one is going to be 23, uh, 23 minus 15. So this is also going to be 8. Okay. So, all of them. So, it's a solution. This one is all right. I will now write it. But let's do the other one. Now, I'm going to cheat a little bit. If you do it in pencil, you can do the same as I do now. Just filling in something different. And this is also going to become different. Okay. So, now I fill in a negative 5 and 2 over 5. Negative 5. Oh, and here I already see negative 5 and 2 over 5. And you see, so if I'm going to, <clears throat> this is going to be 11 minus 5, I'm see 2, I'm see 5. This one was all right. That one was 5 and 3 over 5. But as soon as you come to this one, can you see? So if you subtract, then you're going to get negative 1 and 3 over 5. And sorry, you're out. As soon as you see you have negative, it's out. 
You're not getting marks for that. You're only getting marks to say, therefore, x minus 3 is the only solution. This one should have also been in a negative. I can just maybe show it to you. Okay, so it was that negative one, A, B, C, 2, five, multiply, five, equal. Oh, negative plus 23. But it negative 4, I think that would have been negative 4. So it's actually cancelling out there, and it's cancelling out there. So x, oh, let's just write it nice. x equals negative 3 is the only solution.